Oh my god, don't speak with me like this about her. You have to ask her, not ask me. You just want to take the information and speak a bad lie about her. I don't know. It's just a friendly question. Ask like a group of girls. I want to be the queen of Egyptian hearts. between a women because it's really interesting well when I came here to Egypt to Alexandria I didn't have in Alexandria any friends I didn't know anyone any the boys any the girls only my husband and it was hard but like thanks for my husband I started to meet by my own and from the job my colleagues became my friends and this is how it started actually but every time after I travel abroad I just lost the friends I came back and find another one and lost the game it worked like this but to be honest uh, I cannot call it it's really friendship because the friendship in my idea in my point is it's for death and life it's for Oh my god, this is 
not a friendship. You know what I mean? So, uh, friendship with Egyptian women are really complicated. And then I can tell you another one. It was a group of girls who were Egyptians. And with this group I was actually in the Sahara. Uh, so, but we met there and they were from Alexandria also. So just they told me they, they will take me out. Yes, I met her, they liked me and that's why we could 
be best friends. But Anna, come on. I'm sorry, but I don't see that Egyptian girls are very loyal friends. They will put you down anytime for a man. They will left you because of the husbands. If the husbands will tell you no, you will not speak to her as a friend. I don't want you to have a friend. They will stop it. And that's not what I call friendship, you know. Again, for me, friendship is someone who I can count on 24 hours every day, every single day in the year, for the rest of your life. So it's very hard. Um, I guess I give you a lot of examples about it. You can picture it by yourself now. Uh, but really, it's not easy to have friends here. But it's not impossible. Okay. Bye and thank you for watching.